Wheels up. Good work. C8 Corvette, you've seen this on the channel before. We installed the high wing on this car. We just installed the fab speed exhaust system. Nothing too crazy. We didn't do all the cat deletes and stuff. This is just a muffler back system. Sounds really good, carbon fiber tips and all that. Right now we have the suspension out of the vehicle because we are installing an air suspension on there. We're gonna have an air ride system on there, which is gonna be slammed, goes up and down, all that stuff. So currently we're working on that as well. The shocks and struts went out somewhere to get the airbags installed and then we're gonna bring them back and finish up the system. So. Stay tuned for this beautiful C8 Corvette. A lot more to come. Yeah. Why did you cut this? You didn't need to cut this. You could have just cut it was, this. No, it wasn't. Yes. This was connected with this. This was connected with this. This was your buckle like this. So in order to cut that, I had to cut the chunk up. No. Yeah. Okay, yeah. okay, yeah, yeah. I did it on purpose to ruin it, yeah. I'll never do that. I just cut it. Just cut them. Get the f*** out of here, both of you two. <laughs> I'm gonna get him bad, really bad. I'm not gonna tell him when, but I'm gonna get him bad. We just got the Spirit of Exit back from Powder Coat, gloss black, looks beautiful, shiny. This is actually how it looks without the Spirit on there. So you can install it without actually taking this apart, but to remove it, you have to release a pin. So you can't just jack it. Don't see my video and go over and try to jack Rolls Royce emblems. So we're gonna go ahead and install that right now. Spirit is on there and the wheels, that's I it? I put the spirit on there. I'm gonna have hernia lifting these up. Okay, we are carrying a 26 inch wheel, very heavy. Guys, here we have a newly completed brand new Cullinan. This thing is fully wrapped up in satin white, laminated satin white. Uh, our good customer here did all his cars in this laminate satin white. As you can see, the whole front grille is wrapped and that's actually in gloss white. So we got a contrast of satin and gloss white right there. The emblems are painted black and white. Spirit of Ecstasy is powder coated in gloss black. This car is sitting on 26 inch 50 spoke RDB wheels. It's lowered slightly so it gets that look. Right now this is in low mode. So this is just for pictures and videos. Uh, when you do drive it goes up a little bit to get that comfort again. But yeah, look at this beautiful full satin white wrap with a little bit of gloss white accents and gloss black accents. So really, really Cool looking Cullen in. All right, on Instagram, we put a story for you guys to ask us questions that we're gonna answer on this YouTube video. We're just gonna choose randomly because there's so many. Sarkis, Moses, and I are gonna try to answer them the best uh, possible way we can. First celebrity, that's a very tough question. I don't even remember. Right I know uh, at the time we did an event for Reggie Bush, Dead Mouse DJ came in with a Porsche. This is a long time ago. My memory's not that amazing. Yeah. Chris Brown's been a long time celebrity. So to answer your question, one of those. We don't have any job openings. If you guys could do a better job than Sarkis, yes. by all means, please send us a resume because we are looking to replace them as soon okay, as possible. So you guys have to manage the body shop. Make sure order the parts. Make sure you guys have to write an estimate. Also make sure you know how to speak English. With my broken English, I get what I want. Yeah, and ice cream. Estimate. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, you well, honestly, the older cars, the harder they are. 
Yes. Is that true? Yeah. Yes, yes. All the cars are hard. Because parts are really hard to find. Bentleys are tough to work on, for sure. Teslas are a little bit annoying because things break on Teslas and ordering Tesla parts suck. Yeah. He has experience sure. in that. Yeah, Tesla part is the worst thing is you cannot call an order. You have to do send an email and then the guy, if he's happy, he will respond it back to you. If not, nice. then... Good Thanks, luck. Tesla. Elon. That's a great question. Very coincidental. We are setting that up. So we're going to have a subscription-based uh, product you could order and you're going to automatically get the monthly limited edition product. So we've been getting that question a lot um, and we're going to set that up soon. We'll let you know. Is there a question when I get going to order circus wheels? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Nobody see. cares, man. Nobody cares. They should. I think it was the th um, um, American Pie, some shit like that. Oh my <laughs> God. Come on. Oh my American God. Like the, one of the stupidest movies in <laughs> the movie. That makes sense, right? Are you right? talking about American Gangster? No, it's no. American Pie. American it's, Pie. <laughs> it's funny? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Does he glue his hands on his That one? No, he put in the pineapple. Oh, yeah. The uh, not one. pineapple, the thing. The first um, one, yeah. American Pie. Yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> you know, I think you like that because you tried that. No, I just, I like the movie because it was like funny. And the girl I liked, it was like, you know, one time in a camp, I think La Ferrari. The Fermi, I don't know. So you go that high level supercar? Nice. I think any car, no? Uh, if you choose a car. Every maybe Enzo. Enzo is uh, really sick because also I've heard people do exhaust on Enzos and they don't sound very well. I would leave a bone stock and it looks great. Any Ferrari. Even like a 488? Yeah. No, yeah. Uh, 458? You yes. leave it stock? Yes. No, you have to drop it. Yes. Little bit you have to drop it. <laughs> I like Those Ferrari. cars, even Vic. Now, even Vic told me those cars, you they come a little bit high, so it looks a little bit ugly with the small wheels. But you know what's really cool? We all picked Ferrari. Yeah. Uh, AMG for me. What was it? Definitely AMG. AMG? Yeah. Sarkis? M. <laughs> Better than AMG. M. <laughs> not your, yours is not an M though. Yours is not real. Yeah, but you know, <laughs> the AMG is, is, is not something crazy. Yeah. M is really crazy. Suspension-wise, um, still brakes. No, brakes. that's not, bro. The M packages are like terrible. No, brother. Yeah, they suck. No. Yeah. No, brother. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was, I was on fire. That was bad. M3. Yeah. There is no such a car. Under 80, under, uh, under 100. M3 is like around like 70, close to 80. I think M3 so far for me. And the second one, it will be the Subaru. Mm -hmm. You know which one I'm talking about? With like a huge uh, wing on oh, the back. I like <laughs> Sting, uh, Stingrays. Those are pretty cool. Oh, like the, that's one, the white one? That's yeah, a great one of our customers. Um, very good choice. Nice. But it's over very 100, choice. No? no? No. It's right under, I think. Yeah. I mean, I think you get crazy yeah. options and maybe, yeah, but. I like the Corvette It's stingers. right around nice. there, and that's not a bad, like bad it. choice. I think mine was How the best new, one. How much is new, like, Audi RS 7s and stuff? RS maybe, Those are nice. Maybe something like that. I'm kind of trending towards the VW group with the Audi Lamborghini thing, so. Mine is the best one. He has a higher budget than <laughs> Shit! That was bad, that was bad. Alright guys, we have a brand new Bentley Flying Spur right here. This is a new model. Two or three episodes ago, you guys saw us do that white Continental GT Bentley with the Mansory kit. People went crazy over that car, it looked amazing. This is the four-door version. It's not a Mansory kit. We are going to do different phases on this car. This is phase one, okay? Phase one consists of these wheels, 22 inch wheels, and it's slammed right now. This car is on air suspension, just like all the new modern cars like Rolls Royce, etc. Um, but you can't slam it too much because the system freaks out. So 
I think it looks really good with beefy tires on there, 22 inch setup, three piece wheels. This car came from Seattle actually to do all this work. Phase two is gonna consist of a carbon fiber body kit that is actually made by Bentley. So it's a Bentley OEM body kit that's gonna go on there front, sides, back. It's gonna get that whole kit, it just arrived. We're gonna be installing that. However, we're gonna do a satin black wrap as well. So this thing is gonna get murdered out. It's already murdered out with all the black, but it's gonna be a satin black murder out. We're gonna leave a lot of the black, gloss black accents on there. It's gonna look incredible. Also check out the light on the Flying B. I don't know what they call this thing exactly, but it's got um, lights in the wings. Rolls Royce, with the spirit of ecstasy, they have lights, some of them optionally. This is an option too but they don't stay on when you're driving. This thing actually stays on, so really cool. If you see one of these things on the road, it's dark out, you'll see the wings have lights on. Once again, Bentley did a spectacular job on the new Bentleys. I didn't like Bentleys before, but now I'm becoming a big fan. Really, really nice car. Take a look at the interior of this car. It's got this really crazy red interior, leather everywhere, diamond stitching, um, even the, the interior headliner is red leather. Really cool, two-tone red leather and black steering wheel. And obviously it's got that new Bentley console, which is ridiculously nice. The screen is beautiful. It's all touchscreen, of course. Really, really nice screen. The older Bentleys, the technology sucked, honestly. Everything was like a pain in the ass to manipulate and control. Now everything's much easier. The speedometer is beautiful and clean. Back seats are really, really nice. It's got dual sunroofs, so you could open both of them. So you got individual sunroofs, one and two. You could turn, you could close one, leave the other one open, you could do whatever you like. You could even open this sunroof and it goes over the back one. So really, really cool car. This customer was thinking about doing starlight, but with these two big sunroofs, stars were gonna be limited, so we advised against it. If it doesn't look good, we don't recommend it. So no starlights for this one. And of course, this car is a W12, so 12 cylinder bi turbo just like the white one so it's the big boy engine uh 620 something horsepower from what i remember so really smooth really powerful car as well so this thing literally has it all super excited to wrap it and add that body kit as well so phase two is coming up